Hello and welcome back to a brand new FIFA 17 video today. Today we're going to be starting one of my brand new series that hopefully is rather exciting. Um, of course it's called the best of the best. Basically this isn't going to be a road to glory style series. I want to start a proper road to glory. Hopefully you'll see that on the channel rather soon where it's more that series is going to be more focused around you know trying to earn coins legitimately throughout through the game by playing divisions games whatever else etc etc so this is more going to be focused around divisions for champions squad building challenges uh foot draft whatever else involves gameplay etc um, and hopefully kind of take it from there so hopefully this is going to be exciting hopefully you enjoy the series as well and uh, we'll uh, we'll see how things go. So first things first is we're going to take a look at the squads we're going to be rocking with throughout this series. Uh, the first one is called Pack Pulled. This is more my Liga Santander, Bundesliga best possible squad. Um, so we've got the likes of Moya in goal from Atletico Madrid. We've got uh, Rafael Varane, uh, Godin, Juan Fran, Kovacic, Rafinha. Thiago Bernat, we also have Ribery, uh, Orellana, could be, from, where is he from, from Celta Vigo, nice, and of course we do have the main man himself, Luis Suarez up top, um, you can see I've, I've played a few games with him already, six games, four goals, not the best record for this type of striker, but I'm really struggling to kind of score goals with anybody like anybody at all it's it's really really bad so the next uh squad i'm going to show you is my kind of second backup squad because i use two squads so i don't really rely on fitness all too much uh, if one team needs fitness i'll switch over to the other one and you know just rebolster it that way so this team is probably one of well i've only got two teams but the team that I'm most proud of so far, and you'll, you'll probably see why in just a second. So let's take a look at the team itself, and you can see probably one thing stands out already. Uh, but we have uh, Adrian, Adrian in goal. We have Koscielny, Cabasel, Kapis, um from Watford. No idea. We have Debushi. We have uh, Rose, Walcott, Deli Ali. Coutinho, who is incredible as well, by the way. We also have Eric Dyer, Rashford as, as uh, our main striker. And then, of course, on the right-hand side, we do have the purple and kind of white, silvery gold Sterling, who looks insane. Have not played any games with this card at all. Played with the, the team itself, with, um, with you know, everybody else but um, have not played with this one. So I'm looking forward to it. Hopefully in this episode, we'll play with both uh, we'll play with both teams and uh, see how things go. But, you know, that card looks incredible. Cannot wait. Cannot wait. So there is the teams. There is my two teams that I do have as of yet. Of course, as this series progresses, we might build a few more teams. I've got the Squad Builder Challenge Jonas, which I really want to build a team around. If we manage to pick up the Giovinco, we might have to do that as well. So there is there's stuff there's stuff to do so far. And of course, if we do pick up one of those ones to watch cards, which I really really want to, we might have to try and build a team incorporating them. But um, first things first is we need to complete, which I think it's the marquee matchup matchups. Um, which features three kind of squad building challenges. Um, Schalke versus Mönchengladbach. We have Leon versus ASSE. No idea. Um, we have this one, which is Colo Colo versus Uni de Chile. No idea if I'm pronouncing those at all correctly, but I have completed these and I wanted to show you them before I do complete them to kind of show you what kind of team I build in my squad builder challenges. So, I mean, we've got a few silvers, a few um, bronzes. The the requirements were two Schalke players and two Gladback players. So we've got 
uh, Nastasic, I do believe. Nastasic, yeah, in uh, centre back, and of course Howardes. I could have chosen someone, you know, slightly less rated. He's 84 rated, but you know, I, I don't think I can sell him anyway. No, he's untradeable, so it doesn't really matter. I'm not going to use him, so I might as well put him to good use. We also have Maya as well at centre attacking mid. The where is it? Munchen Gladback players. We have are uh, this guy, the bronze player, Cesar. So he actually looks really quite decent for a uh, centre attacking mid. His stats are okay. Four star weak foot, three star skills is not too bad at all. And of course we do have Thorgan Hazard as the other player. Of course the rest of the team is just made up of uh, German, various different German players pretty much. And there you go. So we get one jumbo premium gold pack for, for completing that one. Which I'm very, very happy with. Of course, these didn't really cost me anything to do. All the players themselves were already in my club. So I just put them in, kind of completed it that way. So this one, we needed two... Oh no, we needed five um, Leon plus ASSE players. Um, one second, I'm going to have to find out what club is that. So, oh, it's actually just called ASSE. Okay. So we needed five of those. Now, I wasn't sure if that was five Leon five ASSE players or five in total so we've got um, the left back centre mid centre mid and centre mid as ASSE players Leon we've got uh, the silver striker who probably goes for quite a lot and I don't really want to get rid of him but it saves me paying vast you know number of coins for any other players so and of course the rest of the team is filled out with different French players we've got uh, Gonalons at centre back because I couldn't I didn't have one I just didn't have a French centre back so we'll complete that one get three what do we get three league oh okay so three league un premium gold packs I'll take that okay fair enough probably the easiest thing I've ever completed ever and of course the last one which was a little bit more expensive because I didn't have many of these players um, you had to have two uni the chili players and two colo colo players um, two nationalities it's not very difficult so basically what I did with this one we, was I put the two players from either side just here so you got left back center defensive mid center back and goalkeeper is those four players and the rest of the team is just English kind of strong links so everyone else has chemistry it's a really cheating way of doing it but it's just really really simple so if I can quickly show you he cost me 2700 coins which isn't too bad um, I have that one luckily in my club 8.3 K I probably I couldn't find anyone cheaper at 2.8 so it was a little bit more expensive um, I don't know, but it's not it's not the worst thing in the world because you only do need two of each. So maybe if I picked a different position, they may they may have been cheaper. Henceforth, I I don't know. I didn't I did not check, but we get three thousand five hundred coins back. So that makes I mean I spent about fifteen in total for those players. So I get back about a, a, you know a loss of twelve thousand coins, which is not ideal to be honest. But there you go. So marquee matchups is complete advance from that one of course we get a draft token pack which means i have two draft entries which is quite cool because uh, i already have one draft entry because i got a draft token in a pack which is quite lucky and uh, we'll hopefully get another one through this one so we'll start off with um silver gift pack which i think was from the web app wow he looks awful 16 shooting Calcio B though, he might sell for a little bit because of course that Del Piero challenge goes for about 700. So, you know, that's not, not too bad at all. 700, we'll put him up for 600. <laughs> Undercut him just by 100 coins and uh, we'll keep, keep the rest. Now, while we're doing this, I will mention that if you have noticed my record, you probably haven't, but I've just pointed out to you. So, my record is as bad as it looks because I tried to get chemistry on some of my players for a squad builder challenge um I, I went into an ai game backed out and you know the means to try and get a um 
loyalty bonus in chemistry. Yeah, that turned out that didn't work, um, and that was totally pointless. So I've just kind of ruined my record for no no real reason. But you know that kind of sets a challenge to try and improve it, which is quite it's quite nice. Um, all right, so we've got three Ligon Premium Gold Packs, which I'll save for last. We'll do the two Rare Gold Player Packs. I wasn't really planning on doing packs today, but we might as well get, get rid of them. So, get Asamoah. It's quite good from Juventus. He had been quite useful in the Juventus um, Del Piero Challenge. But we get CDM. Is that going to be Carrick? It sure is. It sure is. Be nice to get like a walkout or a legend. Oh, Jao Martinho. I'll take that. We also get Moreno, which I already have as an untradeable player, so it's a bit unlucky. Somebody big? No. Nope. Sent back. It's going to be Reedwald. Okay, from Ajax, which is quite ironic. Um, we also get this guy, which I keep getting rid of, and he keeps coming back. I can't. Cannot get rid of him at all. Alright, only had a few of these, so this isn't going to be too long. Centre defensive mid from Wolfsburg is going to be Luis Gustavo. Quite a decent player. He might actually be quite useful for a team if I try and build around Jonas. So, you know, all, all these players help in their different aspects. We get uh, Enyema, I do believe. I haven't got him, so I'll take it. I'll take them, of course, get Janko again. If you could please just go away. All right, so let's do the Jumbo Premium Gold Pack. Legend, please. Nope. Get a right mid from it's that guy with pace, Visser. Visser, who got a team of the season, I do believe, last uh, last year in FIFA 16. He was incredible. Never used him, really, but um, he was pretty good. So do we get any... We don't. We get nobody. Do we really get nobody? We, okay. So we get a Premier League player, which could go for a little bit. I, I highly doubt it. Because most of the Premier League players you need are quite high rated. So, oh. Okay. Well, I stand corrected. He goes for about... I'll put him up for 1.7. So I think that's probably pretty fair. 1.8, actually. <laughs> 1.8. Who knew? Who who knew? All right. So I mean, I'll take that one. Oops. Well, I was going to check his price to see how much he actually goes goes for, but can't do that. All right. So first league and premium gold pack we are going to get. Of course, we can't get Ibra this time because he's moved over to Manchester United. We don't even get close to an Ibra. Don't even get close. We get Lamar, who I have no idea who he is. Who are you? Put him on the transfer. I don't. I don't really care too much. We get quite a few non-rares, which is quite useful because we can stick those in the uh, squad builder challenges. But it'd be nice to get somebody half decent. Is that? Oh, I have no idea who. Is... Oh my god! Wow. No idea. No idea at all. So what we'll do now is we'll jump into the first game and uh, see how things go. <laughs> okay, so we're going to jump into an online season today. Uh, you can see my record. I've been really struggling in Division 10. As laughable as it might be, I don't know, it's just really strange. It, everyone seems to be really, really good at the game and I seem to be really quite crap. So, you know, I'm quite lucky to get promotion, if at all. We've got three games remaining. We need three points. I think it's probably pretty possible. Um, I mean, what is the worst that could happen? If we get three draws, that's probably the worst. But as long as I don't lose all three games, which I hopefully shouldn't do we should be okay all right so his team is going to look like oh okay so he's got a uh, lone carver how he's got abdenor mustachio i think really as the goalkeeper rafinha nazri preho vela 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 it's got Maratta, i think as the striker so it's got a very standard 442 i don't really like the 442 because it feels too kind of standard and slow but um, hopefully we can uh, just go play it slow, really. That's all all there is to it. What was that? Can't take the ball. Yes, good. Nice. Good pass and play. 
Oh, go on, get to it. Yes, go on, smash it. Gotta be... Go on. Oh, my God. Wow. How how has none of that gone in? Oh, go on. There we go. Tiago, get to it. Almost. No, what has happened? What has gone wrong? What? Who has had the malfunction so poorly? Oh, Carlos Vea. Can you please just stop? He's going to try and do some sort of skill that's going to annoy me. No. Yes. Good. No. 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 Finally, the ball, ball roll came off and it, it actually worked. So, if we can score a header, that'd be nice. Please, free header. Oh my god, it's gone in. Oh my god. Frank Ribery, the most unlikely person to score a free kick aerial threat. Not really. Not, not really, to be honest. But, you know, I'll take it. I'll take whatever I can get in divisions. Yes, smash it. There we go. Finally, I've scored a decent goal. I think we're going to have to... Gonna, you, you're going to have to do it. Who is that? Kovacic as well. Gets his first goal for the club. What a fantastic goal that was as well. Just the build-up play. A little bit of um, a layoff there. And a bit of strength. The hold off the defender. And then uh, just smashes it into the top left. Yo, that is terrible. Terrible clearing from the team. Please, please don't do this. Oh, for God's sake. Wow. Go on, nice. To Luis Suarez. Push it back to Rafael. No. Rafinha, rather. Rafinha. Oh, my God. Wow. It, how did that drift so far away from him? In, in in the bag. As long as we don't mess it up. Team, don't mess it up. Yes. Okay. Thank God. First game today is a victory. It was quite a close game, to be fair. You know, <laughs> the better man won. No, it's not really, but... Got kind of lucky with, with the header. I'm not really sure what happened in the header situation for for Ribery. But, um, you know, I'll take it. And then, of course, Kovacic gets a goal, which was a really nice goal. Um, and then, unfortunately, we do, of course, concede that one goal that I just couldn't prevent. But we've got 2,500 coins for winning Division 10, which I'm very, very happy with. Um, you can see we weren't really dominating at all. Possession we were. Um, four shots, two on target, but most of his shots were from range, so don't get deceived too much with those, but there you are. So we won the Division 10 title. I know it's a massive achievement. I accidentally put a Hunter card on him when I was trying to put um, contracts, but to boost his pace, because I've always said his pace needs improving, so his, dri his passing and dribbling is okay. It's perfectly fine. His physical could do with a little bit of work, but um, pace and shooting is actually probably ideal so I don't know how much it gets boosted by I've seen like you know stats maybe it could be plus nine plus ten so if, it, if it's say plus eight that's up to 90 pace with 84 shooting which is pretty good is very very good to be fair um I always like to keep my players on the basic chemistry style to play with them first and then kind of see what areas they need to be improved and then put chemistry style if if need be um oh okay these um these connections are so questionable. Should we play this guy? Dream Team, Dream Team Eleven. All right, we shall. We'll we'll give you a go. Okay, so your Dream Team versus my pack pulled BPL team or Premier League team now rather. So his team looks like. Please don't be. Oh, okay, I was expecting legends like Pele. All right, here we go. I'm really, really excited to see how Raheem Sterling plays out. I've been so looking forward to playing with this card. And, of course, I'm going to use it so much throughout the entire year of FIFA. Um, but, oh, good tackle. But, yeah, I've never played with, with this card at all. So, looking looking forward to it. Um, excuse me. Raheem Sterling, go. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, okay. Oh, wow, that was so incredible. I can't... I don't know how many times I said, I said oh, wow, there, but um, that was really... He just, like, you know, he just powered off. He was off and he was gone. Oh, good Lord, this is bad. Oh, well, that was terrible. Don't know why you would shoot from there. Why don't you try and cross it across goal? Um, okay, I'm not totally sure how that works, but... Oh, God, who is this? Cap Capacelli? Capacelli? 
Holy Christ. Wow, he just like walked straight past my goalkeeper. Or tried to at least anyway. Yo, pass it off to Sterling. He's got the pace. He's going to smash it from range. Oh my God. Wow, that was incredible. That was so good. Oh, come on. Pass a little bit better, team. No, all oh, just choose um Yes, he committed. Oh damn it. Couldn't get the shot off properly. Oh Rashford, Marcus Rashford, there you go. Marcus Rashford gets the first goal. Oh my god, that was so good. I just want to take a look at that again. That was a really good goal. Smashed it perfectly. Good lord, top bins. You're not saving that at all. Alright, the aim today really is to get Raheem Sterling a goal. He's almost done it already. So, if we can just get him a goal, I'll be happy. But his Conor Plyank is injured, which isn't very good for him. Good for me though. It's good for me. Oh god. Oh god, no. Oh, I saw that. Fair play, fair play. That was that was that was good passing. I got totally torn a new one. Oh god, ran into trouble there. Go on, there you go. Oh my god. Holy Christ, Eric was that Eric Dyer? That was. Jesus Lord, you just smashed it straight into the top top right again. Same place Marcus Rashford put it, but uh <laughs> Good lord, wow. Maybe I'm getting better at shooting. Maybe I'm starting to learn how to do it. You know, I say that and it's probably not going to be anywhere near as good anymore. Oh my god. Raheem, Ster oh, Raheem Sterling. Oh my god, I was going to take a shot as well. God, he's just too good, Raheem Sterling. There we go, Theo Walcott. I know he has pace galore. Oh my god, that guy just fell into a different dimension. Oh, okay. I just, I'm just going to do the dab. I've, I don't know what happened there. I have no idea at all what happened. He didn't do the dab. Wow. Really? Wait, okay. Well, we scored a goal. I don't know what happened. So, wow. He just backheaded it into the back of the net. Okay. I just thought that went kind of over Marcus Rashford. And then into the... Or the goalkeeper put it in. Wow. Wow. First half over is a completely different story in this game. Whether or not Division 9 is any easier than Division 10 is yet to be seen. But we're winning 3-1, which kind of implies that it probably is. Or this team that I'm using is so much better, which it probably is, to be honest. I don't know why they dispute it. I mean, it was blatantly obvious that it's a yellow card. You got none of the ball. You took out the entire player. So you need to just accept it and move on. Oh, God. Oh god. Wow, he still hasn't scored. He's tried that shot three times and still hasn't scored yet. You'd have thought he'd have tried a different tactic, but no. No. To be fair though, I've tried the same tactic of booting up to Marcus Rashford, who hasn't won the ball one single time as of yet. And I keep trying it, so, you know, I'm not really one to talk, am I? Well, there you go. Second game is another victory. I, I just don't believe it. Two victories in the space of the same day. It's just unheard of. It's a good victory though. 3-1. We didn't manage to score any, any more goals in the second half. Uh, got two from Rashford. One from Eric Dyer. Incredible, incredible stuff. Of course, we haven't quite got a goal from Raheem Sterling as of yet. Um, but, you know, he's had, he's had chances. And hopefully, eventually, we can get him to score. Just not today. Not today. But there you go. So hopefully you have enjoyed this video. I know it's probably going to be quite a long episode. I, I want them to be a bit longer, more Road to Glory length style videos, even though it's not really a Road to Glory series. But you know what, you, you, can't, you get the picture. So um, hopefully you have enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching. And as always, until next time.